we've had an incredible week. Um, we've had uh, nearly 11,000 visitors, which is nearly another record. Uh, in the exhibition, we've had over 400 companies exhibiting from uh, 37 countries. That's a record for Gas Tech. Uh, in the conference, we've had exciting, challenging debate, trying to solve some of the challenges the industry meet right now. And I think the, the cream on the cake was when His Highness Sheikh Mohammed, uh, the Crown Prince of Abu Dhabi, visited the show. He went round the exhibition uh, on a tour. He stopped at every single stand that was on the tour. So he spent over an hour and a half here. And that was really, really good, fantastic. There's a lot of interest in this region anyway, on the, on the gas side. Uh, we've got a very strong following on gas tech. Uh, people recognize this as one of the best uh, gas events in the world. Uh, the, yes, we're in economic downturn, but people are looking forward to coming out of that downturn and doing more business. So there's a lot of people setting the seeds here. There's an awful lot of networking between the exhibiting companies as well. We've got 1,500 businessmen on these stands and they're not just doing business with the visitors and the delegates, but also amongst themselves. We have delegates here that have been to every single gas tech. That's 24 editions. And there are people who just, this is their very first one and the connections are all there. And a lot of the companies, yeah, they're, they're friends with their competitors. They, they, they go out of their way and there are partnerships formed here and an awful lot of business done. We obviously have the delegates out in the exhibition at the coffee breaks and lunch areas networking, very informal. In the evenings we've had uh, three very special events, starting with the Adnock Gala Reception at the Emirates Palace. Uh, that was in the ballroom, it was a sit-down buffet, splendid buffet, uh, lots of networking and, and traditional entertainment. We then went on to the Chevron Party in the Intercontinental. Uh, they had some very unique entertainment with acts that I've never seen before in the Middle East and it was very, very uh, special. And then last night we uh, ended up with the launch party for Gas Tech 2011 in Amsterdam. And there we had some quirky entertainers from, from Amsterdam. Um, and so the handover of the Gas Tech flag from Abu Dhabi to Amsterdam. Due to the economic downturn at the moment, a lot of companies are finding it more difficult to justify air travel. Uh, we were looking further afield, uh, but uh, took the decision that we would try and be more central to the, to the industry, and Europe seemed a natural choice. Uh, gas Tech's been there twice before, which tells a tale in itself. For Gas Tech, we're going to see uh, continued increased interest in investment in projects. Uh, we're going to see quite a few new countries coming to market, um, 10, 15, uh, and these are positive, real uh, projects that are going to happen uh, and uh, with the security supply being an issue in the last year or so uh, we're seeing a lot more countries showing an interest in LNG plants and that's one of our core business. We've had a few people that have obviously not come this year um, but what we found is that the core delegates, the people who really matter have been here um, and they've been doing really good business so yeah those that have not been here We'll have to read all about it online and, and in all the reports, all the newspapers that have gone on. So, not, OK, they haven't been here, but they can still find information. And those that are in companies that have sent delegates, of course, they're going to get the delegate papers. They're going to have all the information and they'll be shared. And that's why you know, magazines get shared to five or six people. I and mean, we've got people who've been to this event on every single event, every 24 editions. We've got a couple of delegates and they, they know we've got a really law following. Why? because we produce a high-end conference and exhibition with quality people and quality content.